Mackenzie Gerkerhead. And I'm Liam Elvidge, and we are the team leaders for the first half of the USA phase of the Godolphin Flying Start. We've been here in Lexington, Kentucky for about two weeks now, and we're going to check in with the other trainees and see how they've settled in thus far. Hi, my name's Naomi, and I'm currently on the Godolphin Flying Start. Um, we've just arrived in Kentucky, so arrived on Saturday, and so far uh, my experience has been pretty good. It hasn't been that cold yet, so that probably helps. And I also got the chance to see all the Godolphin stallions, amongst which Rustage, who is my absolute favourite. Um, I took my camera with me, I took loads of pictures, and he's in probably like 90% of them. So, so far it's been a really amazing experience, and, and I can't wait for the next few weeks. in Turfway Park tonight. Um, it was my first time witnessing American racing and it was absolutely amazing. I loved it. Yeah, we've been uh, split up into groups of three or four and gone around and visited all the stewards' rooms. Uh, I particularly enjoyed the uh, race we spent with the announcer. Uh, he was a really cool guy and it was great to watch the race with the commentator. It's Norwegian lady in the forepath is coming at him and coming on. Spoofy Doo still fighting and kicking grass. Got through along the inside one eighth of a while to go. It's kicking grass, but on the outside, Norwegian lady is bearing down. It's going to be one of these two with 150 yards left to go. Kicking grass has gained the upper hand. Norwegian lady trying to re rally, but kicking grass for Jimmy Jenkins is going to win by a length and a half. Norwegian lady was second. I'm all about that base third, and long shot aptitude unbridled was fourth. Oh. We had a fantastic tour to Coolmore's Ashford Stud where I actually worked for nine months before in 2015. So it was really great to return and see all the stallions, especially Triple Crown winner American Pharaoh, who arrived there shortly after I left, so it was really good to see him. Uh, Flying Star graduate Scott Calder gave us the tour and it was really great to hear about his experience on the course and he talked about his path to his role in nominations and marketing at Ashford Stud. He also gave us some really good advice for the future and for work placements on the course. So last week we got to go out to a couple of the Godolphin farms that we're doing our work rotations on in the next few weeks. We went out to Gainsborough and Dubai Millennium and it was a great opportunity to see the farms covered in snow which was amazing and also talked to a few of the managers that will be in charge of us and teaching us through the coming weeks. We also went out to Denali with ex-Flying Start graduate Comrade Banderoff. Um, it's just very exciting, we're really looking forward to starting our practical rotations. to get back to being a group and now that we've settled into Kentucky we were actually lucky enough to have a snowstorm which coming from 35 degrees in Australia over Christmas was a bit of a climate shock for my system but it's been amazing. Thank you so much for watching and make sure you follow us on social media. Applications for the next intake of the Godolphin Flying Star close on the 12th of February. Don't hesitate to contact us if you have any questions about applying. Best of luck to everyone applying!